flip, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh my god. Oh, I can't really like that. I hope there's more of them in the main game. Like, more frozen potions. <gasps>Hello there everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's finally cold enough to film VR content again. Although, funny story, I did actually record a VR video yesterday in 40 degree heat for an hour. And that doesn't sound like much to, I guess, some people in America and other parts of the world, but here in the UK, we don't have aircon and our houses are built to trap the heat. So I was sweating like a pig, it was disgusting. And now I'm not even using that video today because I found out that the demo for Undead Citadel is available on Steam. So we're checking this out instead and the sweaty video I filmed yesterday, I'll put it in the bank. I'll use it on a different day. Now, if you haven't heard of Undead Citadel, then I kind of can't blame you. The game's been almost silent completely radio silent for about two years. The last thing that was heard from any of the developers or any update on the game in general at all really was back in 2020 and since then we've heard nothing. And now we have a demo. Now the demo is just the horde mode which is fine. The thing that really excites me about this game is the story mode, but I want to get to grips with the combat and see what it looks like. So horde mode for now is absolutely fine. And this game's kind of like a hell split arena or a blade and sorcery um, or a hard bullet, obviously not with guns. That kind of game, that kind of physics based combat driven scenarios. Now horde mode is going to be very, very familiar because that's effectively what hell split and blade and sorcery is. It's the story mode that does have me excited when this game does launch because so many of these great physics-based combat games don't have a story mode. They've got no real reason to progress or play through. It's something that all of them are lacking. So I'm excited to see what this is like. Because if it's good, then the story mode is going to be something I'm very keen to jump in and play. But for now, let's check out the demo and let's jump into some horde mode. Oh, okay, it looks very nice. It looks really nice. Yeah, it's kind of got a... <laughs> There's going to be too many Hell Split Arena comparisons. It's got a bit of a Hell Split vibe, but it is that kind of broken down, medieval, dark soulsy feeling to it that both games kind of have in common. Fighting skeletons and zombies and hitting them with maces and swords and things. So yeah, there is. There's going to be a lot of comparisons drawn between the two things, especially considering they're both physics-driven combat games. Now. I do believe I need to break everyone's hearts, including my own, right now. Oh, no! Okay, so in the demo, there's like no settings really at all. We've got some we've got some quality settings. Most things are set to high. I'm just going to leave it there. Um, but under general, we just have a reset height, standing vibration, subtitles, and spectator camera. I can't turn on any kind of smooth turn. <laughs> So we've got snap turn, which I absolutely hate. Anyone that knows me knows I hate snap turn. It makes me feel so sad. I think it's just this one level as well. So this might be a short video. I'll run around, kill some zombies, kill some skeletons, give you kind of a, a, a feeling, a general vibe. Okay. About how the game feels to play. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited to chop some zombies up today. Going to let off some steam and some frustration. I feel like I need it. That hand is... Gripping the axe, but also not gripping the axe. That's interesting. Okay, so maybe it's because I'm holding it too low down. Hold it there. Okay, that's cool. It's just a slight bug there. If you hold the axe here, it does count as holding it with two hands, but you can pull your hand away from it. Okay, let's go. Let's start this thing. Let's use the pot. This is going to be my best weapon. Okay, skeletons. Take this. Oh, he didn't seem to care. He didn't seem to care about the pot. All right. Give me that. Whoa. Oh, his head came off. Can I have that sword? I really want to go double swords. Oh, his head's off as well. Give me the sword. Give me the sword. Give me the sword. You can't store a weapon here. I'm not trying. Hey, Oh, this is cool. It definitely has a hell split vibe, and I don't want to keep saying that. Oh, where's his skin gone? His skin's all come off. Oh, okay. His skin fell off. Um, It's one of those. Lift him up. That's it. <clears throat> that felt cool. 
That made me feel like some kind of badass. I appreciate that a lot. Little naked zombie coming. Is he completely naked? No, he's got pants on. Take that. What, you came quickly? Jesus, mate. Whoa. Two hands. Flipping it. Oh, I just, I, any game where you can take the heads off. I just, I just love it. It's so gratifying. Can I take the arms off? I cut him in half. <laughs> I cut him in half. Flipping hell. Okay, I cut him in half. Um, that's a thing you can do. That's exciting. Right, let's uh, readjust my hands. Okay, I'm really keen to chop off some arms if I can. There goes an arm. And again. Oh, there goes another arm. I want all these arms off. I want them to not be able to fight me. There we go. What you do now, mate? Hey? Armless? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What's this? Mate, you've got no arms. How are you going to get back up? Oh, my God, he did. Flipping it. Flipping it. He's unstoppable. And he's so angry now. Why are you so angry now? Four. Gee. Ugh. We just lob this axe at him. Ugh. Sword. Oh, holding it the wrong way. Why am I holding it like that? Jesus. Ugh. That'll do. Oh, hello, mate. You alright? Let me just. Let me just. Ugh. I think he's dead. I think he's. I think he's dead. Wave two. Okay, so one thing I'm noticing very quickly. That's a cool sword. Is um. The kind of when you put something in a holster and go to grab it, it has to be highlighted yellow, even if your hand's right on it. So grabbing things from your holsters isn't always very smooth. But it's a demo. There's time to fix these things. What the f Okay. What the f Honest Oh, there's three of them now. There's three of them now. That's a turnout for the books, isn't it? Um, stay back. Mate, I said stay back. He's got a skeleton head, but a muscly zombie man body. That's an interesting combination. Oh, maybe it's like procedural. Okay, I'm kind of like left-handing right now. That's better. Oh, that's much better. Piss! Okay, weapons break. Alright, come on. Come near me, I dare you. I dare you. I died! He... You know, I dared him, and, you know, he took me up on that offer, and swiftly ended my life. And now wants to continue ending my life, it would seem. That was just my own cockiness, really, wasn't it? Okay, I need to get further than Wave 2. Jesus Christ. I'm sweating. All these games are a great workout. Stealth workouts as well, because you're having fun, and also getting sweaty. Right, I don't think I should be two-handing these. Can I two-hand the sword? No, it's a short sword, I think. Yeah, I don't think it's... Oh, I can two-hand it. Oh, that felt cool. I like their, like, really rustic, shit-looking sword. Oh, get back. What's he got? He's got a little treat. What's that, mate? What have you got there? I want that thing you've got. Whatever it is. What is... Jesus, what is that? What is he dropped on the floor there? What is that? Freeze. Freezy. Drink it. Oh my god, what's happening? Okay. Oh! What the f Yes, please. Give me more of that. I like to freeze people. I am Frozone. The really angry, barbaric version of Frozone. Come on, mate. Check this out. Oh! <laughs> oh. oh yeah, come on now. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. Oh! This is what I'm talking about. Oh, it's run out. Mate, this is cool. This feels a lot faster than Hellsplit. Hellsplit's a lot chunkier, a lot heavier. This feels a lot more arcade -y. It's kind of like a halfway house between Hellsplit and Hellsweeper. You know, kind of like it's got the speed, flipping egg, of Hellsweeper. But the physics-based combat of Hellsplit. Oh! Jeez. I want some more potions. Has he got one? No, he's got blue eyes. Blue eyes, white dragon. Sugar. Okay, yeah, the combat's really quite intense. I. This is my kind of game. Oh, did I break his helmet? I did. Oh, stay down, mate. I just wish there was smooth turn. Give me the potion. Give me the potion. Give me, oh, I can't grab it yet. 
Okay, put it on my belt. Save it, save it, save it. I wonder if there's any other potions other than the frozen one. Right, shield combat, how does that work? Come on, mate, I've got a shield now. Okay, yeah, blocking's easy. Nice and easy. You just hold up and away you go. What is that? Health potion, definitely. What are you thinking, hey? Oh, I broke his arm off. Health potion, is it? Do you reckon? Do you reckon? Can I drink it? Ooh, drink it. Yeah, that, that was definitely a health potion. Butter knife. Mate, I've got this little buttery knife. Oh, it's more of a bread knife. More of a bread knife or a fish knife. I'm not sure. It could be a steak knife, actually. Yes. Okay, now is the time to drink that. Get that in me. Flip, yes. Flip, yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, my God. Oh, I can't really like that. I hope there's more of them in the main game. Like, more frozen potions. <laughs> because that is joyful. Okay. I want, like, a fiery one. I don't know what else ones there could be. Like, an electric one. Some kind of gravity thing. Oh, this bonking stick is my new favourite weapon. Flipping hell! Yeah, favourite weapon. Stay back, Skeletor. Get down the well. Can I go in here? Okay, I can. I can. Yeah, I'm in the house. I'm getting chased by loads of guys. All right, up the stairs, up the stairs, up the stairs. Oh, keep go oh, Good lord, keep going up. Keep going up. Oh, green. Green potion. I've not table over. I've not table over. <laughs> oh, guys, I want the potion. Where did, where'd the potion go? Where? <laughs> No! Piss off you! Oh shit! Get off me! <laughs> Get off! Um. Okay, is it still on the table? There it is! There's the green potion. It's fine. All is not lost. Sight. Give me some sight. Oh my god, who's this? Oh, it's slow mo! It's slow mo! That came at an amazing time because this big dude's rocked up. Oh, it's a. It's a slow-mo that activates when they attack me? Oh, okay, I think, or when I attack? What? Yeah, I think it's when I attack or when they attack. Stay down. I really want this guy's hammer. Do you reckon I can get it? Right, do that. Move him up. Smack him down. I Shoot. need something to kill with! Oh, that was very cool. I think, I think my health's about to go. <sighs> Stay down. Chop his legs off. That's it, that's it, that's it. Mate, what are you going to do now, eh? Absolute dick. You know, if you bonk, you have to be prepared to get bonked yourself, yeah? <sighs> oh my god. Come on, bonker. Yes! Where's that bow? Yes! Flipping heck. Now, I do want to try the bow, but I also have this big bonking hammer now, which just one hit KOs people. Maybe I'll just put that away for now. No! You bitch tits! I was doing stuff! If I put my hand up here, it says I have zero arrows. So hopefully, I don't need to find arrows as well. Um. Right, come on, come on, come on. Get to the bow, get to the bow. There's going to be skeletons. Shit, there's one already here. That's backwards. Ah. Right, okay. Hold it in the hand. Okay, do I got arrows? I have no arrows. Mate, how do I get arrows? Ah. Where are the arrows? They wouldn't put a bow in the game, in the demo. If there weren't any arrows, right? Like, they, they wouldn't... They wouldn't do that, would they? Maybe they would. Maybe that... Get out of my way. Maybe that's the joke. Maybe that's the thing. Maybe that's how it works. Do I need to craft arrows? Surely not. Okay, I guess we're going to have to leave it here and wrap this video up. I cannot find arrows anywhere. I don't quite understand. Like, I have a thing for arrows on my back, but it says zero of 60. So I've got no arrows on me. 
Um, same for the other side, I think. Yeah, same for the other side. So I don't have any arrows. Now, there is a bow just up there. But I've scoured this place. I cannot find any arrows anywhere. I don't understand how I would even make arrows if I could make arrows. Um, I, I don't think there's arrows in here, which is very strange. <laughs> but I guess that's just the way it is. Uh, this has been... Undead Citadel, and uh, yeah, it's a really cool first showing of this game. You know, for something that's been silent for so long, I genuinely worried that it had been cancelled, um, or that it wasn't progressing in any meaningful way. But it seems like... Ah! Uh, it is! Yes, there we go. It seems like it is, and I really like the feel of it. I'm a big fan of the faster VR games. Stuff like... Okay, there's that spiky thing that I'm still looking for arrows. Um, stuff like Hell Sweep that I really appreciate, you know? Stuff that's like blisteringly fast. Oh, the bow's gone. How weird. Um, stuff that's blisteringly fast really kind of does it for me. It's, it's definitely my kind of VR experience. And this has that very, very quick, very, very um, frantic combat, whilst also remaining. It kind of it feels heavy still. There's some real weight to the combat, which I appreciate. And. Um, <laughs> bug off you. Stop following me around. You dicks. Stop following me around. Um, and the thing that really excites me is there's going to be a story mode. Um, according to the Steam page, a story mode of up to 10 levels in length, um, which is, yeah, really, really exciting to me. Because oh, that's the one thing that we need in all of these games. These games are so lacking of any kind of meaningful content to progress through, levels to explore, things to unlock, come, things to see, things to do. To me, you they demons. really are just... Um, just kind of running around smashing people up, which is fun, but we need some more... We need some more substantial content, and the story modes are going to give us that, so yeah, really excited to see this one reach its full potential. Oh, hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please do leave a like, leave a comment, and hit subscribe, and I'll see you very soon for another one. Oh my lordy lordy, that's gone. Oh no, I thought I could grab it from underneath them. I can punch them. That's good, that's good to know. Come here, I'm going to punch you now. Oh, get on the floor, come here. That's it. We've already wrapped up the video, but I'm punching you to death now because I found out I can. Dicks. Oh, okay, come on. Oh, stay down, you prick. That's it. Bosh. Okay, I don't think I can kill them by punching them, but I can punch them around, and that's just a great time. Take care, everyone. See you soon for another one. Download this demo. It's very, very fun. Bonk. Oh, that was good. Come on.